Horse Myths Busted, Clearing Up Common Misconceptions Hello beautiful people, welcome to Rag Sedis blog. Your home of quality spicy videos. Whether you're an experienced horse rider or just have an interest in these majestic animals, it's likely that you've heard some myths about them, but today, we're going to break down these myths and give you the facts. So let's get started. 1. Horses are highly intelligent animals. While they don't have the same cognitive processes as humans, they have extremely good recognition and repetition skills. They can even read human emotions, making them excellent therapy animals. Like most animals, horses have to be trained to understand human commands. But this works both ways. 2. Mares are easier to handle. This is a myth that is often compared to stallions. Stallions can be bold, aggressive, and hard to handle. But this is mostly dependent on the individual horse's personality and how much handling and training they've received. Geldings are usually calmer than stallions, but mares can be every bit as feisty as their male counterparts. 3. All horses need shoes. Some horses need shoes, and some don't. The question of whether a horse can stay barefoot or needs shoes isn't a simple one to answer. Many do find barefoot, and there are even boots available for occasional trail rides on rocky terrain. Horses that have health issues related to their feet and legs often need corrective shoeing to keep them sound and comfortable. 4. Behavior modification doesn't work. There are as many misconceptions about training horses as there are about horses in general. Many believe that training is easy and that behavior modification is junk science. But behavior modification is real science and it does work. Training horses is a continuous process that requires patience, understanding, and proper techniques. 5. Horses only need to be fed hay, high quality forage, whether in the form of pasture or hay, is essential to a healthy horse diet. That said, horses have other vitamin and mineral requirements that aren't always met by hay alone. Manganese, vitamin E, iron, and salt are a few required nutrients. Many horse owners feed their horses supplemental grain to meet these requirements, but they can also be met through vitamin supplements, ration balancers, and salt licks. How much supplemental nutrition they need depends on their lifestyle, workload, age, and condition. 6. Black hooves are stronger than white hooves. This is an old wives tale that has been passed down through generations of horse owners, but research has shown that there is no truth to it whatsoever. In short, don't pass on a horse because they have wide hooves. The hoof structure of a horse is the same from animal to animal, no matter the color. The strength of a horse can be determined through its diet, exercise routine, farrier schedule, and bloodline, but color has no influence. 7. Don't walk behind a horse, this is probably helpful advice for non-equestrians or beginner riders, but it doesn't necessarily apply to experienced horse people. Using caution when walking behind a horse is always advised, as they can kick, but there are several reasons that you might need to stand behind a horse, including driving, long lining grooming their tail, or simply walking around to the other side. 8. Any horse can succeed in any discipline. While there absolutely are exceptions, you may have noticed that many disciplines are dominated by certain horse breeds. Race horses are often thoroughbreds, rodeo horses are often quarter horses, and horse jumpers frequently use warm bloods. Different breeds are built to do different things. So if you're looking to compete at a high level, you'll need a horse breed for the sport that you're in. That said, most horses can be decent at and enjoy a variety of sports. If you're planning on just having fun, there's no reason that you can't jump your quarter horse, they just aren't likely to reach high levels within the sport. Conclusion: Whether you're an equestrian or not, a few of these horse myths and misconceptions might have shocked you. While we once had to rely on information passed down from previous generations, Research is now available to prove and disprove things that we once thought to be true. This brings the video to an end. Follow me on this channel for more relevant videos on